In this video, I'm going to compare LokiNet VPN versus traditional VPN and why you should use LokiNet VPN if you are concerned about privacy and anonymity. Most VPN providers use privacy and anonymity as sales buzzwords, but you can never be sure that they really are. A traditional VPN is just an other centralized system that can and most likely will be monitored by the VPN provider or the government. Instead of your internet service provider knowing that what you did on the internet, the VPN provider now does. As far as privacy and anonymity goes, a traditional VPN is a failure. The VPN provider knows your IP address and that can be traced back to you. However, there is a new kind of truly anonymous VPN available. It's called LokiNet VPN mode. So is LokiNet truly an anonymous VPN? Yes. By using LokiNet's VPN mode, also called an exit node, your true IP address is never revealed to the LokiNet VPN exit node provider. With LokiNet VPN mode, you don't have to trust the VPN provider. They have no information about you. So, Unlike a traditional VPN, where you trade the trust in your ISP to the trust in the VPN provider, with looking at VPN mode, you don't have to trust anyone. How is that possible? That is because Lokinet uses onion routing over the Oxen service node network that currently has over 1,800 nodes all over the world. When you connect to Lokinet, your computer is given a randomized address on LokiNet. Then connections from your computer are encrypted and routed over three random Oxen service nodes before they get to the VPN exit node provider, which then routes your connections out to the regular internet. There is no way for the LokiNet VPN provider to know who you are or where you come from. Well, isn't LokiNet slow? LokiNet is certainly slower than a traditional VPN, but LokiNet uses a protocol called LLARP, or Low Latency Anonymous Routing Protocol. Therefore, it is surprisingly good for streaming services and voice and video calls as those run over LokiNet's native UDP protocol. Downloading programs and browsing the web is slower than with a traditional VPN, but it's still acceptable for most purposes. Keep in mind that LokiNet conditions change as the connections are routed over random service nodes, which are most likely located in multiple different countries, and that might make the connection slower. You can find out all the details about LokiNet at lokinet.org. LokiNet is open source software and it is freely available for anyone to use. My company, Privacy Pro Shop, is a LokiNet VPN mode exit node provider. So I'm hoping that you'd give us a try. You can try it for two days for just one dollar. And you can pay anonymously with cryptocurrencies. And also no name or email are required. Thank you for watching.